All right. Hold still, please. There you are. Now, how can I help you today? Okay, uh, which one in particular? All right, let's see here. A singular murder charge, you mean? Because you've got a few on here. All right, let me see that charge in particular. Okay, I see what you're talking about here. Um, so you're, you're asking why why this charge is listed on your file? Well, here's the thing. Um, in a nutshell, this person's life was not yours to take for the pure and simple reason that this person never posed a threat to you or anyone that you loved individually. You sought them out. You entered into their sphere um, and so, other than the fact that, you know, you ended up pulling some vigilante justice, you know, um, you cannot, for the most part, there are circumstances where the rules bend ever so slightly, but not in your case for this person in particular. You performed vigilante justice, if for better or worse. And in my personal opinion, for the better, because, you know, the planet that you lived on could do with far less of these kinds of creatures roaming around, but that's neither here nor there. Humans at large cannot be trusted with vigilante justice because ultimately at some point you do not have a line to, and to, to cross anymore. It all blurs and becomes one large gray area. So here in the afterlife realm, we, we give that a hard stop. We nip that in the bud pretty much from the get-go. So it's it's not really a matter of like good and bad. It's a matter of should and shouldn't. And we err here on the side of shouldn't because that kind of activity is not something that humans can do for long periods of time with an even hand and with clear vision. So even though for the most part you will not get a whole lot of condemnation from really anybody here on this side, technically speaking, you took a life that was not yours to take. So therefore you do need to answer to that in some fashion. Fairness is a slippery slope, trust me, because fair is fair not universally. But I will say that um, looking at your file here, the, the, the associated punishment that you will be receiving for this particular offense is going to be mild in its absolutely mildest sense. So I wouldn't fuss too much about, you know, having to deal with some kind of repercussion for taking this particular person's life. It's it's not going to affect your experience here all that much on the negative side. So I hope that gives you some kind of consolation and clears the air a bit with this charge. Unfortunately, no. You don't have to agree. Um, to be fair, most people <laughs> coming into this office do not for the most part, agree with the charges on their files. But as long as you at least understand where we're coming from, that's as good a start as any. Okay, we can work with understanding. So were there any other questions that you had for me at this time? 
All right, then. If there's nothing else, you may be dismissed. Have yourself a day.